Hi everyone, welcome to Archers. Today we're going to take a look at how to set up one of the most under-publicized feature of Windows 8, the new backup feature called File History. It is extremely easy to set up, it is free and is already built into your Windows 8 machine. So let's take a look at how to set up File History. First, go to Control Panel. Then click on the File History. On the left hand side, click on Select Drive option. Here you can select what drive you want to back up your files to. You can also back up your files to network drives. Click the back button and click on exclude folders option. Here you can tell file history to not back up certain folders of yours. Now go back to the main page and select advanced settings option. Now this is actually important. Here you can select how often you want to back up, set a size for offline cache, how often you want to keep various versions of your file. Here you can also clean up various versions of your files that you don't need. This will save some space on your backup drive. And that's it. Now you can click turn on and you're done. So what happens if you accidentally delete a file? If you delete a file, go to Restore Personal Files option on the left hand side menu and select the file and hit the green button to restore that file. What happens when you unplug your external drive? File History will store all your backup files to a cache and when you plug your hard drive back in, it will send all those files to your external hard drive. I know there are other backup softwares like CrashPlan that gives you much more comprehensive backup options, but Windows File History is extremely simple as you saw and it's already built in so you don't have to download a third party software. Please let me know in the comments down below what kind of backup tool you use. Once again fellas, thank you so much for taking your time to watch this video and have a wonderful day.